Alright, I just crossed probably the second mile. Got another mile to base camp or to group camp. I'm gonna have lunch. So I take a quick video. This is Forest Glen, my first solo backpacking trip. It's beautiful. Nobody's out here really. I gotta turn around once already. <laughs> Can't help that though. I'm learning. And it's all good. There's some beautiful shots of a little water, a little stream going through. Beautiful sounds. Man, I wish I could just sit right here for a while. But I have goals, I got practice. I'll have more to follow. Hello everyone. Alright, I made it three and a half miles on the Forest Glen Preserve backpack trail. Moderate trail. One good climb. With my backpack as I stated before. 40 1.18 pounds. It's heavy. I feel like I feel like a skinny guy here. Do I look like a skinny guy? <laughs> Anyways, that bad first time. Two, just over two hours, three and a half miles. This is the first campsite, group campsites. They're all throughout. It's beautiful woods. I'm gonna get something to eat. Take my shoes off. Kind of relax a little bit and go on to my campsite. What a wonderful thing it is. I can tell you this. Shout out to all the guys on Hammock Forum because I'm getting me a hammock. I made it up to the Vermilion River. It's beautiful. This back country is a little bit strenuous for me. I still have to go up that ridge, get up on top. I figure I should make camp about another hour or so. Maybe an hour and a half. Depends how tired I get. I just come from down in that ravine. Oh, it's a good hike for a beginner. Thanks, Grizz. Whew! Man, I sure wish I had a hammock. All right, here I am at camp. There's my Kelty Phoenix two-man tent. I have a 55-degree bag inside with a self-inflating pad from Cabela's. Sitting up on the ridge. I just want to give you a whole view of my campsite. There's my fire, my table, I'm getting ready to cook supper. There's my bag. It killed me today. It killed me. I don't know how good this is going to turn out, but we'll see. Uh, for all of those who don't know, this is my first overnighter. I did seven and a half miles. Oops. After driving three miles, I am beat. It's my first long hike. It's my first overnighter. And I'm hungry, but I really want to go to bed. But I'm going to have me a little bit of coffee and a little bit of food. Watch the campfire, do a little writing. Then I'm going to go down and get some water, or maybe I'll get water in the morning. Because I'm really tired. Uh, I set up the tent. It took me about 20-25 minutes um, with a tarp underneath. Being tired. So I imagine I can get it down to like 10, 10 or 15. But as I searched for a site and looked around, I'm really becoming aware of the value of, uh, of a hammock. Because even a novice, novice, I'd have had it probably up in about five minutes and I had a really comfortable chair. I'm glad I got this picnic table, but I really need to lay down. Nobody told me how bad my feet would swell up. <laughs> All right, this is from Forest Glen, uh, inspired by Grizz, and uh, he made it look a lot easier than what it was. That's all. Good morning. Day two. I'm hoping to make it out of here because I'm pretty well beat up. Three and a half miles to go. Camps broke down. It took me about an hour. Good hour, hour and a half. 
um, but I wasn't moving too fast either. So, beautiful morning. The sun's just coming up over the trees, as you can see. Uh, I'm going to switch out my hats here in a minute. But, uh, three and a half miles to go to the truck, and then I'm done. Which is kind of good, and I'm kind of sad, but, um, you know, I'm hurting. So, I learned a few things. My tent gets a lot of condensation. Uh, even ground's really important on a tent. Comfort is, um, pee bottles. Gotta say it. Handy. Uh, and let's see, I overdid it. Yeah, that's the biggest one. Both weight and length of track. So, here we go. Mountain hanger here. Just finished the Forest Glen. Uh, learned a lot of lessons. First backpacking trip. That's all I can say. A lot of weight, a lot of miles, a lot of up and down. It's only 11 miles, but I made seven and a half yesterday and finished the rest this morning. But uh, a lot more strenuous than I thought. So, this review is very nice. It's a beautiful thing. Um, if, especially if you're experienced and you have uh, a lot of weight uh, or a lot of light gear. <laughs> Mine was 41 pounds. And this was my first backpacking overnighter. Definitely want a hammock for you guys at hammock forms. This is my tent drying out. I actually could drink water off of that thing this morning. It was a Kelty Phoenix. Um, got it for $45 off of uh, eBay, I think it was. Or Sierra Trading, one of the two. It was pretty nice. But, uh, about 4 o'clock this morning, it was like uh, I was feeling water drip down on me. And, uh, it got pretty cold. I gotta get a better sleeping system, too. So it looks like hammocks, here I come. Other than that great trip, I'm exhausted. But I made it. I'm on my way. Yes!